Hello everybody, I'm Sal and I'm going to show you a quick and easy way to create a single button to run two instances of OBS and another single button to put those instances to record your screen and your camera using Elgato's Stream Deck. And if you want to learn how to make the two OBS instances to have your camera and gaming videos in separate tracks, watch Naughty for details. Once you download and run the application, I'm going to leave the link below. Go to the Stream Deck options and select Multi-Action and click and drag that to an empty box. From here, you're going to go to the System options and click and drag the Open Action. Select it and go and click on the Choose button and find your executable. I'm going to select the first one, which is my Cam OBS for my camera only. I'm going to find the executable, select it. At the end, you have to have the portable flag here or as a shortcut to your desktop. If you don't have the portable flag in your executable, OBS will not work as two separate instances. I'm going to name this one as Cam OBS. You can copy and paste one and find the next one for your gaming or uh, screen recording, or you can do another action drag. So now I'm going to select my game or screen OBS and find the executable, do the same exact thing, and put portable. I'm going to rename this as game OBS. So now I have my OBS for my camera, my OBS for my screen game uh, recording. Now I'm going to go to my off position and I'm going to select the hotkey. Click and drag that. And I'm going to click here to assign. So basically this is going to record your keystrokes. I'm going to do Alt and then the F4 key. And then I'm going to select Control C to copy, Control V to paste, or you can just right click, copy and paste. And you just need to have two of those because there's going to be two instances running. We're going to go back. Now I'm going to press the button in my own, in my stream deck. There's two. There's my cam. Of course, it's off. And my gaming monitor, which is my screen, which I have another instance of OBS running to record this video. But I'm going to press the button again and it should go. Both of them should go away. There it is. Then you can just assign a on off. So this will be on, this will be off. So you can just assign whatever icon you want from file, or you can create a new one, or you can go to the uh, Stream Deck library online. For recording, it's also multi-action. And what I did for that, I selected a hotkey, which in OBS, if you go to file, in settings, you can set a key to work for start and stop recording. So I have one for my cam, which is F6, and F9 will be for my gaming. Um, I tried making them the same one, but it didn't like it, so I just left it uh, my key separate. And that's what I have under F um, under my on position and my off position. I have the same thing. So just to show you what I did, basically you just go back and do a multi-action switch, a hot key. That will be my cam, another hotkey. That will be my game. Then I select Control C to copy, go to my off position, Control V to paste, Control C my on, Control V on my paste. Okay, and let's execute the program uh, again. And notice they're not recording but I'm going to press the record button that we just created and both of them are running. Now I'm going to select it again to stop both of them. And now I'm going to turn both of the applications off. And that's it. If you like this video, please subscribe, give it a thumbs up and uh, thank you for watching.